Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you are new here. I'm gonna be doing some more fashion-y things. I really do enjoy the brands of clothing that I kind of go towards. Um, Killstar has been my number one baby. I have an addiction, I'm not gonna lie. I am very much addicted to Killstar clothes. <laughs> I, I, yeah. <laughs> so I made two purchases because they just had two releases of stuff and I had to send the first one back because everything was way too small. Uh, they had, usually, when it comes to Killstar, usually I can gauge whether something needs to be upsized or I can get it at my size and be comfortable and be able to fit in it. Everything was described as a relaxed fit, so I bought them all smaller <laughs> because usually when it says relaxed fit, they're like a oversized kind of flowy fit, but all of the things that I got were all a certain material, so now I know for the future if they have clothing of this material to upsize <laughs> everything was way way too small like even for my normal size i would have had to upsize so i sent that all back and they should be getting it tomorrow and then hopefully the exchanges will be made and i will get my uh true sizes my actual sizes so i can show you in a different video so that works out so i you know the secondary one did arrive today i've never received a package from killstar in a bag like this before though so i'm a little bit worried i'm just gonna get in here oh it smells it smells really bad oh usually everything i order from killstar has come in a box i like that the bag is very them it, yeah it's very them got their logo and everything on it but not a fan of it not being in a box okay so some of these things were clearance and on sale so I need to try them on <laughs> so this was the last one of this item on their website it is the what is it the stargazer kimono and I guess that's why it's handwritten because it was the last one so it is a, just a, like a throw almost. It's a small, so I'm a little worried, but I have a feeling it'll be okay because it's a kimono and it's probably gonna fit exactly how I want it to. Oh my goodness, I love it. I can see me wearing this, like on a day-to-day -day basis. Hello. It smells bad though. I, I don't know what's up with that. It smells kind of bad, but I am loving it. <laughs> I kind of say I'm really, really loving it. It's got tassels everywhere. And it, I have a dress. I have the Stargazer dress. I think it is sold out. It is one of my favorite dresses. It's like this crushed burned velvet. <sighs> so it is nice to have that in this form. So you can definitely you can definitely tell it's a small but I can't feel it because it's a kimono and no matter what it kind of just looks good um, I'm pleased it works I was worried a little bit about it but I figured since it's a kimono it would be okay which it turned out to be so I'm glad the next thing in here oh I'm worried about this I am worried about this so it, the collection that was giving me the, the hard time was the New Moon collection on there. All of the New Moon stuff, you need to either get your size or possibly size up. It may say that it is a relaxed size, but it is not. Oh, thank God, it's stretchy. All right, so this will probably fit me, no problem. I got it in a large, I think. Why do they smell so bad? Like it smells, ew. It smells really bad. I don't have a size for this. Where are you, size? It should be a large, but I have no idea. So this is the New Moon Corset Skirt. It has a corset belt, which I really ugh, like. Ugh. And then it has, and this is so much softer than the other 
material for some reason. Like the other material wasn't this soft, but it's a really soft, high-low kind of skirt. It's higher in the, no it's not. Okay, so it is just a skirt and then it has a slip underneath because it is see-through. But it is a very cute skirt and it's very summery, but like summery goth. So like it's perfect. And I really like the corset belt and I can see this definitely working for me because it is, I was worried that it was like this material and actual corset all the way around, but it is a nice stretchy material. So this is definitely gonna fit because my body and its proportions don't make sense. I have wide hips, but I have a small waist, so it will fit. <laughs> so this is the Maidelin This is a lace sundress. It is the Madeline sundress. And it is a lace sundress. It's summer. I don't have many summer clothes. A lot of my dresses are very thick materials. They aren't breathable. So this is a lace summery dress. It has a pentagram kind of front part over the chest, which I hope doesn't go too deep because I do have a large chest and I do not want to flaunt it, but it does look like it is a plunge, so it's probably gonna flaunt it. But it's very nice. It's not super soft. It's almost like a tablecloth kind of feeling material, the lace part. The slip underneath is pretty soft though, so that makes up for it. So this won't be necessarily touching right on my skin, but this will be very, very nice to wear out, honestly. Uh, it's very, very stretchy. So I just, it's very hit or miss with Killstar. You never know. You never know what their materials. Like, I was very worried that this said lace, but the material, especially the back, is incredibly stretchy. The waist is incredibly stretchy, so this is gonna fit. You could probably size down if you are interested in getting this um, or get true to size, but it is very, very stretchy. And I got it in a size large. Ah, I got this for work. So this is... Ooh, it looks very nice in person. So I got this in the extra large because it did look very small. Um, it is stretchy though, so I probably could have gotten a large, but this will fit very nicely. It is a very almost formal military-esque kind of button-up shirt. Uh, the material is kind of stiff, but that's okay. Um, I do like it. I think it's gonna look very nice on me, actually. Uh, it's gonna be very formal and uh, with a pencil skirt I think this would look bomb so yeah I got myself a nice little work shirt um, it was like part of their military looking kind of line so like I never really truly had interest in it because of the way that they kind of paired the model uh, it just wasn't my cup of tea but when I started to like think about it you know, in the workplace without the hat and like the button up with a, uh, like a pencil skirt or something like that. I was like, oh my goodness, this would be so cute and it's work safe. <laughs> so that is the Abyss Patrol button up top and I got it in an extra large, but I probably could have just gotten it as a large. It's pretty nice. So I'm glad this makes me feel so much better because my last purchase, literally everything had to go back uh, for an exchange. So everything looks like it's nice and it's gonna fit nice. Part of the reason why I'm buying this, buying like new clothes is because my wardrobe is so outdated. I have not like gotten new clothes since high school outside of the occasional t-shirt or two. So I'm, I want to kind of just redo my wardrobe and get rid of a lot of stuff. So this is, what is this? The Feral Relaxed Tee, and I got it in a medium. And I love their t-shirt material. Uh, this is a little different material though, feeling than the other shirt that I got from them. It says, fuck off humans. And it's got a 
really pissed off looking cat on it um, with bats in the background, a red moon, just a black cat. I love it. It's very cute. <laughs> The way that the model had it, she had it like tucked in so it just it had the top part, it didn't say the bottom part. It was like in like with a little skirt. But I, I love it. I think it's really cute. <laughs> it's not, I, I don't know how I'm going to wear it because I'm not, I don't, I have a, I have a slight issue with wearing clothing with like expletives on it out in public so that might just be something that I wear to friend events and or like for filming or like pajamas or something like that. Um, I personally just don't like wearing clothes out that say that kind of stuff, but at the same time, I wear clothes out with like demons and stuff on it and like satanic symbols. <laughs> I think it's more so that I don't want a kid to see it and then like say it, you know what I mean? I don't know, I digress. And then the last item in here I don't know what this is either. The Greta Maiden blouse, I think. I think this is part of the same line as the lace dress. Ooh. This one I'm worried about. So this one is slightly stretchy, but it's not very. My problem with Killstar comes with the arms, the armholes. Where, where does my head go? Okay, my head goes here. Oh, it's off the shoulders, okay. So my problem with Killstar usually comes into play with materials like this. So there is no slip to this either, that sucks. Um, and the arms. So the top or the dress or the pants or whatever, it will fit perfect. But then it's almost like it doesn't fit perfect around my arms. It's tight, so tight around my arms or so tight around like, I don't know, like odd places like the thighs or something like that. You can't, it, I can get the shirt on, but then when I go to put my arms through the holes, it's like, oh, I, I can't wear this. But it does feel like it fits when I just kind of like shove my arm in there. Ooh, that looks nice. It's got really, really awesome sleeves. Like, I love this. This, like, witchy, sorceress kind of vibe. I, I just, I love the, like, the bell bottoms, but for this, the sleeves. I love that. I love that so much. So it feels like it fits pretty nicely. I will have to try it on. And, of course, I plan to do a try on plan to wear this in this video so that you can see it. It's just as I'm filming it right now, I can't really tell you how I feel about it. That I got this in a size large. So that is my size. So it should technically fit. I'm a bit mad <laughs> that there's no slip. I will have to wear like a cami underneath or something like that. Usually they come with something underneath. I'm fine with showing off my skin. Or, or, or I could pair it with a really nice, what are they? They're like the showy bras that aren't really bras. Bralettes. Really nice bralette I could wear underneath of it. So it feels like it's gonna fit me, so hopefully it does. All right guys, so I will probably come back at some point, hopefully maybe with the voiceover or um, my face telling you my final thoughts after I've tried everything on. Hopefully I will. Otherwise, I will definitely let you all know on Instagram how everything fit. What does this say? I'm so goth, I haunt my own house. So I, I've noticed sometimes they slip in little like sayings on their tags. It just was poking out at me. That's so super cute. Um. So yeah, I will definitely let every, you know, you guys know on Instagram how everything fit and my final thoughts if i do not in the video and post i uh, so yeah definitely follow me on instagram because i want to do more on it i want to uh inter interact that that is my primary social media it, instagram and twitter so if you want to interact with me at all if you want to reach out or anything like that definitely do it on like instagram or twitter or something like that um that is definitely where i'm going to post a lot more thoughts and like 
kind of outfit of the days and like makeup stuff and witchy stuff and you know tarot stuff that kind of stuff a lot of stuff <laughs> so yeah guys um i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was um it was very good for me personally uh to open up a killstar package and because that last that last package that i got just it hurt me so bad that everything had to go back I do not like to return stuff, um, it is, but you know, with the cost of Killstar, you know, I gotta leave the house. I just, I can't not take that hit. <laughs> so I had to get some exchanges, but that was just so painful. So opening this was great. Everything fitting and feeling like it's gonna fit, I don't know, we'll find out, uh, it was pretty great. So yeah. Alright guys, so I'm gonna go. I will see you all in my next video. I do not know what or when that will be, but I hope to see you all there. Bye guys.